We start with two seed Arkansas appearing to take on this LSU team that features the pitcher of the year and the player of the year in the league. Dylan Cruz, one of the top prospects in the draft. Everything that matters, Paul Skeens has dominated. And for me, Tommy, that's why he's the Golden Spikes winner. So it's not just what he's accomplished to this point, but also his future. On the mound, he comes with his own accolades. He does. I, I think if it wasn't for Paul Skeens, that Hagen Smith would probably have been the SEC pitcher of the year. Eight wins, second most in the SEC. He also has two saves. Fifth in the league in case you'll see four pitches slider. His time in the bullpen and now as a starter and he dispatches Cruz like he was an eighth grader. One, two, three. He's a very uncomfortable at bat. And just like that, back to back K's as Pearson gets fooled. Incredible the impact yep. these two have made. White to the left side past Caleb Kelly in a two out single. He came in with high expectations and they've met them. Hard to equate. It's a home run every seven at bats. Shallow right field. Borfin took a bad route, started back before coming in. And LSU will take advantage. Runners at the corners now. Here. Well, jammed him, and that one's going to drop for a knock and drive in a run. LSU fans loud early. One nothing Tigers. Third straight two out hit. The birthday to the national champion. Strike three on the outside edge. Smith bounces back. He strikes at three in the front. And overthrew that one for a leadoff walk. Well hit to right field. Jobert has uh -oh. it and trying to double him up. The throw to first. Ooh. Came in on a roll. Here's the one two. To short. Thompson with the leap and grab off the hop of the mound. What a Ooh. catch by Morgan. Man. Here's the payoff. Mm. And it goes with the slider to strike him out. Wagner frozen by that one. Mm -hmm. Some of it's even true. Swing and a miss by Jobert on the breaking ball from Hayes on the bump right now. Mm. Took strike three at 96 right at the buckle. Little dribbler to third. Mm. Funny hop. Kelly on the run. Ooh. Got it. First out there wasn't a strikeout turned in by Arkansas. Comfortable. Peyton Holt at the plate and a fastball fisted into right field. It's a two out single. Peyton Holt's like my new favorite player. 3 2 to Cole again. Ground ball to Thompson. Shortstop with a double clutch. And retires his counterpart. No runs, a hit. Uh, you're making your pitches. Hagen Smith kind of looks liberated, right? First lead. Yes. Tape wrist, eye black, so. I love it. Thatcher, thanks for your time, man. We appreciate you joining us. Great job yesterday. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. It's, and he shoots that one through the left side. Back-to-back -back singles for Travinsky and Morgan for the second time in this game. Man, it's interesting. They keep. And there it is. Bases loaded for LSU. And he enters in a bases loaded situation facing Catcher Alex Malazzo, 7 2 with a 4 1 1 ERA for Hunter Holland. Hey, it's interesting. Most of the year they would start games with Hunter Holland. And oh, boy. And that one gets to the backstop. Scrambling home is Travinsky, and LSU leads 2 0. Back to the fastball for the strikeout. Tenth strikeout by Arkansas pitching today, but the one. Got him. Is that the knob? Guess not. Got him on the guard, I think. Comes home with the one two, and it's chopped up the middle, and that one gets past Dugas. Headed to third is Wagner. Arkansas trying to get something cooking here in the fourth with nobody out. Oh, and that one gets through the right side. Wagner scored. Slavens throws on the brakes at second, and oh, he wow. is back. Somehow he crawled the around ball. the tag of Jordan Thompson. I think the the ball ended up on the ground, Tommy. Bounced up the middle, and Holt's got a hit. Slavin's around third. Arkansas has tied this game at two on Peyton Holt's second hit of the contest against Paul Skeens. This, this kid's unbelievable. Getting ready for the NCAA tournament. And he overthrew the fastball. Push into center. Thompson racing back and makes a catch as he takes it to the ground with him. Tied it to uh -oh. We're going to bring on. everybody back out.
Catcher's interference. Wow. And so let's try it again. Catcher's interference, they let the play progress until it's over, then give the offense a choice of whether or not they want to accept it. Oh, look at that. Do you see the mitt? Watch the mitt fold. See it? Could you see the mitt fold? Look how it folds there as the bat enters the zone. Yep. After you, the call on the field of catcher's interference is confirmed. <laughs> Batter runner and all runners advance one base. LSU is charged a challenge. And that one gets through past Dugas. Hold his score. Here comes Roland. And Arkansas has taken advantage of the catcher's interference. A two run single from Jace Borfin. Cooper's 3 2. Right to Gavin Dugas. And Dugas takes care of it to finish the fourth week and then lost their next two. Hayden Travinsky with a leadoff single to start the sixth inning. Goodness. Three hit game. Injuries they withstood, or do you judge them based on the current roster? Morgan sends that one into center field. Travinsky will stop at second. Hayden Travinsky and Trey Morgan have combined to go six for six today. To the left side, Cole goes to second for one. Holt. Uh oh. Instead uh -oh. goes to third and got him. Peyton Holt is playing out of his mind. This is a play middle infielders practice. Not a ton, but they do practice it, and it almost never works. Turn that ball on Jordan Thompson. Brayden Jobert sends it to right field. Jace Borfin has it. Chris Burke walks us through this double play. By well, it, you know, it's, it's hit to the hole, so you know you're not going to turn it on the speedy Thompson, and then you just rip your head around and throw the ball with anticipation and accuracy, and you know your pitcher loves that. Mm. Morgan State got beat by Arizona State in Scottsdale. Swing and a miss. Couple upsets. Everything's starting to take shape for Arkansas. Oh. Good Dugas taken away by Cole oh, and my. got him. <laughs> Slavens did all he could. Boy, on that look, it looks like the foot. After review, call of out is overturned. Runner is safe. LSU. There's been some exposing of that here down the stretch. Ninth pitch of the bat results in ball. And it gets a huge strikeout for the second out. Chopped to third. Picked up on the run by Cali. And that will end. The LSU threat in the seven. So you always had somebody to catch your bullpen, which is bottom of the 11th. Wagner strikes out, K number four for Cooper. Ball laser to left field. Wagner over to get it. Two strike single for Hayden Travinsky. That one gets away from Roland. And an easy 90 for Travinsky. Into left field. Here comes Travinsky to score. The throw goes into second. It's another single, but this one produces a run. Jordan Thompson giving LSU life here in the eighth. Another strikeout, it's now a season high for LSU. Holland's got seven of them. Hunter Owen will get the ball to start. That one's past Morgan and into right field. And Callie's got a one out single. They built such a monster there from a facility standpoint that their recruiting is just crazy deep. Bob Walker off the hook in a postseason. Strike three, another K for Cooper. That is seven now. He's done his job. We head to the ninth. Last chance for LSU. JB's in the postseason. Skies it down the right field line. Slavin's there. One down. 
And Cruz belts this one to left field. Wagner's out of room. It's gone. We've got a one run game in the ninth. Mm, three straight. So it's a good mound meeting. And to get a ground ball to short, Call gathers. And Arkansas uses two pitchers, Smith and Holland, to shut down the most productive offense in the league. And the Razorbacks notch a 5 4 win to advance to Saturday. A heck of a baseball game. Pretty crazy to think that the one of the defining plays was catcher's interference. Mm -hmm. You never led, know. Led to a continuation of the inning and a big rally by the Razorbacks. But that's a that's an Omaha type of matchup right there. Wouldn't shock me if we see that one in a few weeks.